It's now been more than 24 hours since nine-year-old Omari and Humphrey went missing. Good evening, everyone. I'm Stephanie Parkinson. This is a story we first brought you last night. Now it's been more than a day since anyone has seen Omari. And the search has not let up. We're going to show you a picture of the nine-year-old boy here in just a moment. That's Omari in there. Now police and hundreds of volunteers in Davison Township have been working through the night. NBC 25's Drew Moore is live from the command center. That's where those volunteers are meeting at the Lake Callis Recreational Area. Drew has the very latest. Drew. Stephanie, a steady stream of volunteers have been coming into the Lake Callis Grand Pavilion here all day searching for nine-year-old Amarian. This is the area right here where he was last seen as he was visiting the park with his foster family. Now, I spoke with Amarian's mother earlier. She's hoping one of these volunteers that are inside that can help her will help her bring her son home, son home safely. And she says running off isn't like Amarian. First thought is, where's my son? Where can he be? Like, he never runs off. Keisha Humphrey says time stood still after she found out her nine-year-old son, Amarian, went missing. How long has it been? It's been like a million years because every hour is like 10 hours. And she says she will stay here until she is reunited with her boy. I'm going to be out here as long days if I have to. Days. Davison Township Police Chief Rick Freeman says the size of the park makes it difficult to search quickly with the, the professional search teams that are that do this. This is what they do, and they're helping us out right now. Well, the park itself is approximately 40 acres. Complicating the search, Omarion has severe autism. He can't speak, but will respond to his name or his nickname of Mars. Omarion's mother says she hopes to see her son's smiling face again so she can spoil him. First thing, we're going to get him an Xbox One. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to hug him and kiss him. I mean... He probably have to pry my hands from him, but. That's right. We spoke to authorities just before we got on air, and they said the search area is actually two square miles surrounding the park, and they're asking anyone who lives in the area to go outside, check your property, check your outbuildings, check your garage, check your pools, check anywhere that you think an eight-year-old boy could hide, and if you see a Marion, make sure you call 911 right away. For now, reporting here live in Davidson Township, Drew Moore, NBC 25 News. Thank you, Drew. And we will be following this story both here on NBC 25, online at mynbcnews.com, and on our sister station, Fox 66, all night tonight. So be sure to stay tuned for.